first question it is given that eels are able to generate current with biological cells called electroplates and these electroplates are arranged in 100 rows so there are 100 rows okay so we can say that m is equal to 100 and uh, in each row there are 5000 electroplates okay a body of fish containing 5000 electroplates that means n is equal to 5000 the arrangement is suggestively shown below each electroplate has an emf of 0.15 volt meaning the emf of each cell is 0.15 and the internal resistance is 0.25 ohm okay and they are asking us to calculate the current okay so to calculate the current what do we need we need the voltage divided by the resistance isn't it now for this type of mixed grouping we have to calculate what is the voltage okay now you know very well if there are many cells connected in series yes so the voltage of each cell adds up so let us say each cell is having e voltage so the total voltage for n cells will be n times e okay so this is one point and these cells each row n e n e is connected how many times it is connected m times in m rows okay so therefore we can say even though uh, they are connected m times they are connected in parallel combination so we know that the parallel combination voltage remains constant so the final voltage okay is going to be n times of e okay now let's come to the denominator in the denominator we have this external resistance capital r and the resistance of this entire combination okay now in this capital r is let us say capital r itself but in the combination we have r cells connected in series so we have r cells connected in series like this so n n times it is connected so that is equal to n times of r but this n time of r okay these n r cells are connected how many times they are connected m times okay so if they are connected m times we know that it is equal to the resistance is equal to 1 by n r plus 1 by n r and so on you can go on up to m times so the final resistance will be equal to m divided by n r 1 by r dash will be equal to m divided by n r so what is r dash from this it is equal to n r by m okay so substituting this here so we are going to get n r by m okay so now when you simplify this you are going to get n epsilon divided by m capital r plus n small r divided by m so this m i can go to the numerator so you are going to get this is equal to m n epsilon into divided by m r plus n r so now let us substitute the values so we are having m how many rows are there 100 rows and in each row how many cells are there 5000 each th each cell is equal to 0 0.15 volt and again here you are having 100 into 500 that is the external resistance plus 5000 into each cell is equal to 0 0.25 ohm so when you calculate this what are you going to get so 100 into 5000 into 0 0.15 divided by so here you are having 50000 plus 5000 into 0 0.25 so can i write 0 0.25 as 1 by 4 so if i divide it i'm going to get 2500 by 2 and you are going to get 1250 here in the denominator so 1250 therefore 100 into 5000 into 0 0.15 divided by 51250 okay so 10 i can cancel and then when you simplify this you will get 1.46 which we can roughly round as 1.5 ampere okay